Now, President William Ruto has dismissed his entire cabinet in response to protests by young people accountability and good governance. The president, however, retained his deputy, Rigadi Gashagwa, and Prime Cabinet Secretary Musalia Mudavadi. The president directed principal secretaries to take charge of government operations as he consults various sectors and political formations before re reconstituting a new cabinet. It's not going to be business as usual with the kind of reality we are faced with now. I am going to do a soul searching on how we need to move forward. In an unprecedented move, all 22 cabinet secretaries and the attorney general will no longer have the national flag on their cars and the trappings that come with the office, or at least until President William Ruto reconstitutes his new cabinet. And after a holistic appraisal of the performance of my cabinet and its achievements and challenges, I have today, in line with the powers given to me by Article 1521 and 1525B of the Constitution and Sections 130, Sections 12 of the Office of the Attorney General's Act, decided to dismiss with immediate effect all the Cabinet Secretaries and Attorney General of the Republic public of Kenya, of the cabinet of Kenya. President William Ruto, while announcing the dismissal of the entire cabinet, said the move was necessitated by recent protests calling for a lean government responsive to the needs of the public. Even with the progress we have made, I am acutely aware that the people of Kenya have very high expectations of me. And they believe that this administration can undertake the most extensive transformation in our nation's history. Deputy President Brigadi Gashagwa and Prime Cabinet Secretary and CS for Foreign and Diaspora Affairs Musale Mudavadi are the only survivors in the purge by Ruto. In what could be appointed to a more inclusive government, Ruto says he will consult different sectors and political formation instituting the new cabinet with the aim of setting up a broad-based government that will assist me in accelerating and expediting the necessary, urgent, and irreversible implementation of the program that we have, including other radical measures and programs. Principal secretaries who are by law the accounting officers will be in charge of the various ministries until a new cabinet is formed. The reconstitution exercise is likely to see a major reduction of the number of ministries and a sizable in line with austerity measures announced by the president last week. This is the second time in the history of the Republic that public pressure is occasioning the dissolution of cabinet. With this move, President William Ruto hopes to renew his pact with Kenyans. John Jacob Curia, Prime Edition.